so joining Willie and me are retiring National MP Tohenare and Taranaki-based columnist uh, Dion T uh, Tuta. Kia ora koutou. Dion, we've said that it's going to be a tough fight. How tough do you think it's going to be in that seat? Uh, well, it's going to come down to the two, well, my view anyway, I think it'll probably come down to Tururu and Annette. Of course, you've got Rauri Waititi there and uh, Pat Spellman, who I don't know anything about, actually. But um, Tururu is, you know, as the leader of the Māori Party, understands that, um, you know, if he doesn't win, that could be the end of the Māori Party. And that's a, that's a significant hurdle to face. So he's out there working really hard. Annette as well also knows that with the... the how close it was last time that she stands a real chance. So yeah, I mean, I think it was like 1,800 between the two Something of them. like that. Yeah. So it's going to be, this is, for me, is probably the one to watch, the, the real, of all of the Māori um, electorates, this is the one to watch for me. OK, um, and, yeah. and Tau, who is Pat Spellman? Dion just said we don't, we don't know much about Spellman him. Pat Spellman is a uh, radio announcer down in uh, Bay of Plenty in Tauranga. Um, he's running with Brendan's party, the New Zealand Coalition of Independence, or whatever they call themselves, um, has got as much chance as um, Australia had last night against you. <laughs> <laughs> and, and a bit of a wasting there, you think, too, at the end of it. Um, a clutch of settlements lately, Willie. We've had uh, Ngāi Te Rangi, Rangi Nui, some Arawa Hapu, and of course there's, there's two hoi. Do settlements have any impact on an election? Oh, really, because... Um, National does them, and Finlayson's doing a good, uh, good job. Labor does them, did them. Cullen did a good job. Uh, this, uh, so it's not really going to affect uh, anything in that seat. Spellman, as Toe said, will get about 200 votes if he's lucky. Uh, but it's a, it's a fascinating seat to watch because you've got the warrior queen. You know, Annie is a warrior queen, and she's getting hundreds at her hui. But the hundreds don't necessarily translate in terms of the votes on the night. If she can motivate and activate the, the, the youth down there, she's got a real chance. Well, she's, the... she's really focusing on women, isn't oh, she? Oh, no. If, 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 wonderful. I've, I've been watching the campaign. A hell of a campaign down there. And, and uh, women do turn out to vote. That's right. But she's up against the conservative sort of vote of Te Arawa, who uh, um, gravitate towards Te Urudu. Uh, but I wouldn't count her out at all. You know, it's, as Dion said, it's a seat to watch. But also, I watch Waititi too, because he's the outsider, and, and these two could uh, could uh, could almost knock each other out because they're that they're that close. I mean, he's an outsider. He's a roughie. No, he needs to lose the hat. Yeah, he needs to stop, lose the hat. Yeah. He needs to stop wandering around and, and playing the cowboy. <laughs> I mean, you know, that was Dover's bag, you know, and we should leave it to history. I, I think it is one of the seats to watch, yeah. um, but I, um, like I said last week, if I had a lazy 20 bucks, it'd go on uh, to the door winning. Okay, um, just a, a side note, we haven't heard much, Dion, from um, Hone, so we see, you know, and it's going to be in this, this tough fight, not much from the mana side of the internet mana party. Why do you think that is? Good question. Uh, <laughs> really good question. I don't well, know. let me put it to the panel. I mean, do, you, do you guys have any thoughts I, on that? I, I, um, I, I think the, the, the worry for Annette is that the, the, the brand of mana mm. has been tarnished with the, the internet uh, mana uh, part of, uh, of the campaign. I, I actually think that, that people will turn off. I think people have turned off. You've seen a lot of pe young people go to internet mana uh, mm. booze-ups um, but they're not, they're not registered, they don't, they don't vote. The key thing here is getting people to vote for so you. So are you yeah. saying that, that, the, that Mana is keeping its head down? To I not be tarnished, he's further saying, tarnished he's, he's, he's saying the brand is tarnished. I say, yeah, I and I'm saying he's talking a load of rubbish. Um, but be because you, <laughs> because but you. he's talking a load of rubbish because young people are gravitating towards no, uh, not. internet mana. They're excited by Free it. Beer. They like all the internet stuff, despite all the right-wing rubbish that Toe and his mates are trotting out. This is probably... Oh. Uh, this is the sort of, you know, the old style... I'll give you a bet now. I'll give you a bet now. You'll lose. That, that <laughs> Tudor wins the seat. The, I'm, I'm not saying Tudor won't win oh, the seat. Oh, now... Oh. Oh, okay. But in terms of the party vote for internet mana, you can see it going through the roof at the moment. And we're talking minimum 3%, maybe 5%. Young people like it. <laughs> they like the internet, despite these old fogies like Toe oh. trying to talk them down. Have you got a Twitter? Yeah. Have you got a Twitter? No, I don't do Twitter. Oh, you don't, don't do, do that. All right, guys. We have, to, no, no, we have to leave it there. We have to leave it there. But right. you are going to get Forget another that. chance. You are going to get another chance very soon. Scotty will be back with you guys uh, just a bit later in the programme. Scotty.